Hi, this is Ryan from Silencer Central to show you how to take apart and reassemble a Banish 22. The Banish 22 is designed specifically to be super easy to clean because we all know rimfire units are very, very dirty. So what we want to do is remove the muzzle side that's actually knurled for your hand to be easy to remove. And then, depending on how many rounds you've shot through it, you may be able to get your entire baffle stack out. If that is not the case, we do supply a tool that will allow you to remove the end cap or we machine the end cap on the part I already took off the suppressor itself. Okay. Once you want to reassemble the suppressor after it is clean, you will notice there is one baffle that's different than the others. I call that one the deep bucket and those are the short buckets. All you have to do is reassemble all the deep buckets next to each other, put the short bucket on the end, and then if you look at the suppressor itself, it's got indexing lines throughout the whole unit. So you just want to spin those baffles around and get those in the vicinity of each other. It will work if you don't do this, but it will be in its quietest configuration if you do. So we'll complete that, just like so. And then we want to make sure that that short bucket goes onto the end cap side of the suppressor. So we just drop it on like so and reassemble. If you did actually end up having to take this end cap off, and obviously you won't be able to use this when you do put it back onto the suppressor itself, you'll just get the tool that again will supply and make sure everything seats itself nice and tight. Make sure you check us out on silencercentral.com and we appreciate your business. Thank you.